Kenny, despite all the hype about this game, have you got to treat it like any other? Yeah, we have. You know, we're obviously looking forward to it. And, um, you know, it's, uh, I'm sure for a, a club like Sunderland coming down, they'll, they'll face this all the time when people look for that fixture straight away. And, you know, we're no different. Uh, but, um, yeah, it's a big game. But similarly, you know, we've got Gillingham and Fleetwood away next week and they're equally as big a games. How important is it, unlike the last home game, to start on the front foot? Yeah, we, we want to start well, but obviously the opposition are trying to do that as well. And um, for the Charlton Graham, we were, I, I, I think, a little bit underwhelming at the start of the game. And, you know, we can talk about the goals, but we didn't really affect them enough. And uh, bringing the crowd into play, we certainly did that, did that in the second half. And by the end, we are unlucky not to get something out of that particular game. But, um, yeah, you know, in terms of our performance and taking responsibility ourselves, you know, we want to try to address that. Both teams are where they are, but uh, not so long ago this was a Premier League fixture that gives you an idea of the magnitude of both clubs. Yeah, and very well supported as, as you know, man, many sides in this division. It's a great division this year, and you know, even you look at a, 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 a Bradford and the crowds that they get, and you know they've struggled uh, so far this season. So show that shows you the competition of the division, and, and as you say, you know, magnitude of the support is a, is a great reflection for League One. Brings you then to the halfway point. What does the manager think so far? Yeah, obviously we've put ourselves in a good position and that's all we've done so far. We've given ourselves a chance. We're not necessarily playing catch-up. You can't get anything, you know, you can't get anywhere. You can't, certainly can't get promotion by Christmas, but to some degree you can be out of it. You know, there's stories after of great runs, but you give yourself a lot to do if you're, if you're not there or thereabouts. And, you know, for, from our point of view, um, the points total, number one, that we've got, but also, you know, the the heart in the performances um, bears well and something we can base the second half of the season on. You've always come back like at Barnsley from a setback, so it, that stands you in good stead. It does, and you know you have to respond, not fall away, uh, show your character, and that's going to be the case all the way through. And if you want one of those promotion places, you have to have a consistency about you, both as, a, as an individual and as a team. Anything on the injury list? No, the only one we sort of missed last week was Luke McGee. And um, obviously, you know, his, his um, hand isn't too bad, but we'll need two or three weeks off. He's maybe two weeks down now, which is good. And, and anyway, you know, we've, we've, we've a lot of confidence in Alex Bass inside the club and, uh, you know, pleased to, to, to bring him back from his loan spell. And he, he backs up Craig uh, again this week. Other than that, you know, we have a, a fully fit squad to, 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 to choose from. Christmas period, do you enjoy it? Yeah, I do. And, you know, for, for a lot of people... Christmas is great and you know we're, we're the same and football's a big part of that and I would always want that to be the case.